For years, I have used the Moleskin notebooks. Take them everywhere I go, put them in my backpack. I like the form factor that fits in my sport coat jacket pocket so I can take it around with me to business meetings. But there are a couple things I don't like about it. One, it's relatively small. So you can't put as much information on it. You can't make a big diagram. Um, and so it's a little bit limiting in that regard. So I tend to have a lot of them actually on bookshelves over here um, for different time periods. Also, they don't have any page numbering, so you have to either number the pages yourself, or I, have in one case, actually bought a little machine from Office Depot that would go ka-chunk, ka-chunk, and then it would um, put page numbers on there. I found an alternative that seems to be working really well, and I wanted to share it with you all. This is just a simple notebook called a lab notebook, and it's what research scientists will use to record their lab notes. And you can get these at a university bookstore or if you search on Amazon for lab notebook. What's kind of neat about it is it's ruled and it is numbered. So it's already numbered. It's a little bit bigger than the moleskin. At first I thought, well, this might be a little bit uh, too big but I find it works out well because I'm always taking my iPad with me and this is really just the same uh, size as that iPad. And so I've been using this for about a month or so and I really like it. And I can make an index in the back of it where I can put in my, uh, well, index to various things I wanna reference later. So I find that much more convenient than the moleskin. Obviously you can stickerize these and what's kind of cool about it is this is much cheaper than a moleskin. I think about half the price. Um, even though it has slightly less pages, I think you get a lot more on those pages. So I think you get just as much um, material, if not more. And, um, and it's all uh, pretty convenient. So I just wanted to share that with you in case that um, helps some of you out. Check out your local university bookstore and ask them for a research lab book. Mm -hmm.